I'm not really ready to head indoors, but it is time for dinner. Well, luckily, I know a spot with the best of both worlds. Time to head to the Midland Beer Garden. It literally is a garden. Well, a greenhouse to be more precise. A place to kick back, grab some food and a beverage, listen to some music, and hang with the tortoise. What? A little different, I know. But that's how owner Jorge Hernandez Jr. likes it. My dad owned the nursery okay. already. He started it in 1996. He was an entrepreneur. He just came out, started a nursery, right? All right, all right. When I turned 21. I went to New York City, and I traveled all over the place. But I went to a few beer gardens, and I was like, you know what? I, I have a garden. <laughs> Let's add some beer to it. <laughs> We started out really small, and then it took off. It, it may have started as like a nursery with a beer garden. Now it's like a, a beer garden that sells some plants on the side. Yeah. Is that kind of, that's kind of what I'm figuring out. That's kind of how it is. And sure. the cool thing about the oil field is, you get all these people from all over the world coming to this little corner of West Texas, and they all say the same thing. This feels like home. Well, what I love about a beer garden vibe is so much different than the sort of bar that uh, I guess Americans or Texans have known for decades upon decades. A beer garden's a totally different thing. It's about the community. Exactly. It's about the person you're sitting and talking with. Exactly. And there may and be music, but it's mostly about friendship. Everything that we do is to promote like person-to-person -person contact, meeting new people. So that's why we don't have table service. We want you to get up out of your table, go to the bar, get in front of somebody that you don't know and maybe strike up a conversation. So you won't find any distracting TVs. It's about the people you're hanging with. And if they aren't any good at conversation, well, you can always just watch the tortoise eat. Ooh, I'm getting hungry. From this small trailer, you'll find some insanely delicious food, like a burger made of brisket that's ground in house and sided with some amazing fries and homemade poppers. All right, here we go, dinner time. Starting off with a little jalapeno poppers. Homemade nonetheless. Oh, dude, that is a legit jalapeno popper. And this angry mayo is making me very happy. I've got a few I'll share. Yeah, you get one too. Oh, <laughs> not all of them. Look at this, pork fries with like three different sauces on them, one of which is called like a mumbo sauce. Not even sure what that is, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be delicious. Ooh, hmm. This might ruin me from all future french fries. All right, house ground brisket burger. Really good burger. Incredible. That's a solid burger. Mmm. Woo! If you liked this video, chances are you're gonna love another video that's somewhere right about here. Or you can visit thedaytripper.com. But above all, what I want you to do most, remember the Alamo. I'll see all y'all out on the road. Bye, con Dios, amigos.